Hey folks, Randy here doing cut and trim. So they really don't get much more straightforward than this. Uh, I needed to replace the fuel lines on the uh, walk behind tractor that I have because they were completely disintegrated. Um, the clips were all put in funky places, so I just kind of yanked everything out. Because, uh, yeah, it's what I did. Uh, so I don't know, man. This is really easy. I just had fun recording it, so I wanted to show it to you. You know, you just take the existing. Uh, uh, fuel lines, measure them up to the old ones, cut them, and just put everything back the way it was. Really, really easy to do. Um, but like I said, I enjoyed making this video, so I figured I would just talk over it. <laughs> uh, this uh, is on my DR Power Walk Behind tractor. It's a 2002, and I'm doing a bunch of work to it. I had to replace the uh, ignition switch i had to replace well all the fuel lines and uh it ran here but the the carburetor is really clogged up with all kinds of junk so i've ordered a brand new carburetor and that'll be coming on next uh it's really weird that it ran though because now it won't run at all <laughs> uh, but as you can see this is a really easy job to do uh it took me no time at all um, i basically recorded the whole thing and it was only like eight minutes of footage and that was just me recording the whole thing so i hope you enjoyed this i hope my narration wasn't too annoying uh it's randy's doing cut and trim have a good one